Cold weather is not stopping local basketball fans from getting out and about in Manhattan before tonight's Sunflower Showdown. That's where we find KSNT News reporter Raina Garcia live in Aggieville talking with those fans tonight. Raina. Jace, if any of the fans here in Manhattan aren't already lined up at Bramlage Coliseum to watch the game in person, they're most likely at one of the bars here in Aggieville. Now, the bars started to fill up around 4 o'clock and will most likely be packed by game time. And while K-State has only won 93 of the 290 matchups against KU, Wildcat fans are feeling pretty confident that the team can pull off an upset against the Jayhawks tonight. Hopefully the Cats can pull it off this season. You know, being a senior, I haven't seen them win at home versus KU. So this is a big game. So we're coming off a pretty hot season, and I'm just looking forward to how they're going to play tonight. Bragging rights aren't the only thing on the line tonight. And K-State is currently tied for first in the Big 12 along with Baylor. But the Jayhawks aren't far behind. A win tonight can put them in the mix for first place. Live in Manhattan, Raina Garcia, KSNT News.